If you peed on oh, an electric fence, could the electricity travel up the stream and kill you? No. Electric fences are not continuous power sources. High voltage, but very low energy pulses. Kind of like high temperature in a reactor, it doesn't tell you how dangerous something is by itself without looking at power and energy. Well, as the pee leaves your body, the stream droplets. actually breaks into separate droplets almost right away. And since they... That's going to occur within a couple of centimeters. And once it breaks, electrical continuity will drop dramatically. Technically aren't connected, the electricity can't travel through them and back up to you. So resistance will get on the order of mega ohms due to the gaps, and urine conductivity is comparable to that of salt water. This is a bit like losing coolant contact. Heat transfer will collapse even if temperature stays high. Now if you got super close and peed really hard, oh, really? the all right, you'd have to get within millimeters, which at that point you'd risk inadvertently bumping up against it. Stream would hold together long enough for the electricity to climb up. Current will flow if voltage overcomes resistance, but this isn't nearly close enough. But the fence's electricity would only be strong <laughs> enough for a quick little. <laughs> so electric fences are limited to milliamps per milliseconds, orders of magnitude too weak and too brief. 